Uh, I'll. <laughs> I'm not gonna ask him, but we'll just make this my sub count for 800 because I know he'll say yes. All right. Anyways, three, two, one, go. Uh, it'll start at 2 p.m. Oh god, I pressed start. It'll start at 2 p.m. tomorrow. Two p.m. I also got home kind of late last night and didn't install my new SSD or my new webcam. So neither of those things uh, are up and running yet. <laughs> Also, I couldn't believe, like, I knew that the, the, the M.2 SSDs were small, but I didn't realize they were, like, this small. <laughs> like, look at how tiny this thing is. Look at, look at how cute it is. It's so cute. Yo, the double. Yo, the full magic. Yeah, basically. <laughs> yeah, they, they go right into the motherboard. Uh, this is a random seed. Yo, this escape is amazing. Yeah, Shwin, hope you're doing well. Hope you're doing well. It's up zero rush. Uh, the benefit is it loads things faster. Uh, it's not going to be a 535 escape because I paused for like 30 seconds to show people how small this SSD is. <laughs> Dude, bomb in the top wall is too meta for me. Oh, there you go. See you later. I wonder what the fastest escape time would be if you got, like... <sighs> what would the fastest kill be? Like... Alright, I guess the fastest game might be, like, Mirror Boots... Next year, Bad Jenny, Wendy, Yacht, and yeah. What? 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 Yo, Loki with the 500 biddies getting that new cheer badge. Hell yeah. Thank you very much for the support, dude. I appreciate it a lot. And that he a. He a with the 2000 biddies. Thank you very, very much. I appreciate it a lot. Um, 
So yeah, I think boots in the first chest, and then three straight swords. Uh... Yeah, boom wouldn't be worth the menu. Well, actually, it wouldn't. There wouldn't be a menu yet. If you got boots, three swords, the boomerang would automatically equip. Uh, yes, real Sonin. You always get an, a weapon. There's one of seven weapons you can get from the uncle. Yeah, you'd menu to mirror. Ah, uh, yeah. So it would be that menu. So it might not be worth it. Who knows? Yeah, we're talking about fastest escape. Uh, it should still be there when I get out. Yo, and a sword. This escape is dope. Yo, Legend Donnelly, welcome to the Pug Farm. Hope you enjoy the new emotes. Give my boy... Need a big ol' thank you. Why is my timer red? What splits am I running against? I'm running against my NMG splits. Cool. Alright, we get a red timer today. That's a god himself. Uh, I think that's all I got. Oh, that's not what I wanted. There we go. Yeah, we're rich. I'm rich! Take this. The music is different. Oh god. Oh god. Okay, we're good. Yes, tournament matches are Thursday at 10 a.m. Eastern and 6 p.m. Eastern. We get one EU friendly time and one America friendly time. That's a pet Fabian. How's it going? Uh, it's exclamation mark MSU1. Um, match three is on Friday, and it's a best of three, so there is no match four and five. What's up, Sarah? Red boomerang. Flippers. Blue cane. Alright. Is there a prize for the tournament? No, it's all for bragging rights. Uh, there's a four cash tournament starting up. Uh, qualifiers start tomorrow, I think. Uh, Schwind. A seventy-five hundred dollar prize pool, with two thousand dollars going to first place. Oh, it starts today. I haven't signed up for any, any of them yet. Can you believe that they're just gonna give me two thousand dollars? It's great. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. I'm actually pretty curious as to who the 8 is going to be. Because I know some of the top, like, rando players that, or like the top NMG people that do rando, some of them aren't participating. Uh, see you, Wookie. You're yeah, nice, Ricky. What did I just get? Silvers? Yeah.
Is it ALGND or ALGND? Either way, good luck with the seed. <laughs> yeah, it'll be. I mean, I'm, I'm gonna be. It's it's unfortunate that uh. Well, no, it's not live anymore, Futon. Uh, the live bit got scrapped because they couldn't get things in order in time. So it's all online this time around. But there'll be a live tournament next year. But it's still sponsored. Can't handle the higher pitch sound. What do you mean? You mean the the higher quality sound that isn't the normal game audio? It's not something that I fix. <laughs> it's something that I am making it do this because I want to. So uh, yeah, pretty much uh, the real Sonin. Um, you know, you have to go through the escape, so there's like that number of chests that you get always, and then you generally will go through Kakariko, and then depending upon what you get from there, you can make other decisions. <laughs> what? 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 Alright, oh god. What? Oh god. Actually, let's check what this is. by removing the decimal and yeah. Weird. Uh, yo, Sarah with the two thousand dollars. <laughs> Thank you very much for the uh, super generous donation. There's no, there's no period there. It's, it's, it's a smudge on your screen. Uh, thank you very much, Sarah. <laughs> I appreciate it a lot. <laughs> oh god. So, why didn't he get stunned before? Is it because I'm menu? Okay, so like, he gets stunned, right? If I menu to something else before the boomerang hits, does it, like, not actually stun? What the hell? That's super weird! I didn't know that was a thing. <laughs> I wonder if that's a thing in vanilla. Yeah, thanks, Random. Uh, and yo, Asixis with the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you very much for the support, I appreciate it a lot. Welcome to the Pug Farm. Hope you enjoy the new emotes. What's up, Kadeza? Yeah, I mean, there's, there's, <laughs> it, everyone has their own different, like, style, you know, like, there isn't a 100%, or, I mean, so, so there's definitely, like, given, like, option A and option B, there's definitely, like, logistical better options, but just because it's the better option doesn't mean it's the right option given the circumstance, you know? So like, and then there's also like, you know, 
Like, if the seed is giving you certain items that are kind of, like, breadcrumbing you to an area, you know, you should probably, you know, go where the seed is telling you to go, rather than doing other stuff. Boots at Sahashala, is this even randomized? <laughs> yeah, this one's going pretty decent so far, sub plan. Dude, Glan, I just learned something about this game. <laughs> Can you believe it? <laughs> Maybe it's randomized or exclusive, but I need to find it. I need to I need to test it. Yo, what's up, Taylor? Yo, Kelsey. Hi, Andy Lesson 3. Kelsey with the 105 person host. Thank you very much, Kelsey. I appreciate it a lot. Thank you, thank you. Hope your uh, your second no reset was fun. What I learned? I learned that if you throw the boomerang and then menu to something else before the boomerang hits, the boomerang doesn't actually stun it. The item. Am I gonna get a mustache to match yours? You know it. 213 your second run. Dang. That is rando exclusive? Weird. That shouldn't happen normally. What happened in your your second run? Uh yes, the hammer. Uh the hammer does tempered sword damage. Trying to find a YouTube video of me playing the GBA version of this game. I don't think I uploaded it to YouTube. And it was using Game Genie. Yeah, that sounds about right. dash all the way over here, whatever. Oh, yeah, I can see if it works with Blue Boomerang, too. I don't know if there's anything... I don't know if I can stun the guys that are here. So, we'll do it... We'll do it to one of the guards that's uh, on the way to... The <clears throat> on the way to Kakariko. Yeah, this is just a normal randomizer. Just a standard. I don't want to be here. If you have to choose between dipping dungeons that you can't complete or getting all one-off overworld items that are out of the way. Um, that depends. I know that doesn't really help very much, but thirty-four months. Jiminy Dilgers. I forgot to boomerang enemy. Oh neat. Okay. Well then I don't care anymore. Um Yeah, it <laughs> it's a... Uh... At that point you it would it would be like item density. It would depend upon what the dungeons were that you can't complete. Um, but, yo, Finn,
Um, Uh, Finn, thank you very much for the 31, 34 months in a row, excuse me. Uh, appreciate the continued support. And, uh, Keku with the 16 months in a row. Thank you very much, my dude. Yeah, it might be gone. I don't remember highlighting it. I might have. It might be on Twitch, but I honestly don't remember. Uh, no, not yet, Kaiku. I have to get it ground still. fighting Aghanim, so that's cool. Oops. Oops. I can try the blue boomerang stun thing, but apparently it's a known glitch. Yeah. A known glitch that's getting fixed in V30. So, neat. Surprised I didn't know about that. When is V30 coming? Uh, good question. I don't have an answer for that. So, Glove could be an Eastern, because I didn't do Eastern, but other than that, I don't have any other access at, at this moment. Yeah, it wouldn't be a bad idea, but I don't know how that would work. And, like... I don't know. I guess. That works, I guess. Yes. Yeah, that makes sense, Coaches. They don't want to update it in the middle. Uh, V30 is going to be a really big update. Not necessarily in terms of logic, but it's going to be a very big website update and just like back end update.
It's a level one. What's my tourney command? It's tourney. Uh, no, this is not from A Link Between Worlds. <clears throat> it's not the vanilla music, but it's not from A Link Between Worlds. It's, uh... Uh... We're just gonna full highlight Aghanim, because it looks weird half-colored. Um... It's done by, uh, Z-Rio. I think that's what it's called. Take you go to Pod. Well, one is for Aghanim 1 and one's for Aghanim 2. But, I don't ever, you know, click for Aghanim 2 being dead. Find out. It was not money. Alright, we're out of here. We're gonna get some money real quick. What'd you miss so far? Uh, a bunch of stuff in the light world, but no progression items. I can't do that either. Uh, this is... Uh... <laughs> I don't know how I'm supposed to get money. I could go into Eastern and get money, I suppose. <clears throat> oh. Hold on, I'll figure it out. Well, we'll do the old school Hulahan method. can't do the easy ways of hula hand because I don't have a glove and I do have the flippers. What's in Lumberjack? Don't know. Should probably check. What says seven days, Kelsey? Sense. 
All right, we can do mortar pod. Actually, I can. I have the hammer. I uh, am not focusing. This is good. <clears throat> yeah, thanks, Seta. Thanks for lurking. I appreciate it. So I want a death warp down here. Uh... How long did it take me to learn how to hover? Um, I knew the theory and like, I knew how to hover. I just couldn't physically do it until I saw Jaden do it in person at SDQ 2014. And then it took me, you know, years to actually get consistent at it. Fire Rod will open up Skull Woods when I get there. Okay, that opens up a little bit more. So now I can actually get to Skull Woods. Uh, cool. All this money. And then we're out of here. Alright, so there's an item at Helma. looked at the Dark Old map, but I can beat Thieves Town and Skull Woods in their entirety. <clears throat> um, we'll take a look at what else I need. I'm a Cane of Samaria and Titan's Mints away from being able to beat Turtle Rock, which is pretty crazy. Kana Burna gets called Kana Brian just because of a super old speedrun meme. <laughs> Alright, so we got Pod as a pendant, we got Skullwoods as a good crystal, Thieves Town as a pendant, and Swamp is the other good crystal. Okay. <clears throat> no, we don't need any medallions. Medallions are for squares. Thank <laughs> you. 
Music has changed because I'm using the MSU one chip that's in my SD to SNES to play different audio files that I have. Uh, there is no medallionless Misery Meyer entry, only for Turtle Rock. Without EG, at least. You can get into Meyer with EG, but. Uh, there's no way to get into Meyer without using an in- Oh, well, no, you can use Out of Bounds, but it requires an in-dungeon glitch. Uh, you can't get into the vanilla Meyer entrance without the actual medallion. But Turtle Rock, you can fairly easily. Phone died. Yeah, I plugged it in, but my charger wasn't plugged in. I unplugged it yesterday for something. <laughs> so that's not very helpful. the second item from the other Skullwood's chest. I feel like I did. Because I only have the map. Uh, nice menu. Uh, I only have the map. Might have been a small key. Yeah, it was a small key. Okay. Yeah, we're fine. So, I need to get the second item still. Because I got the pot small key, and the Gibdo small key, and if that other chest was an item, I wouldn't have any small keys at the moment. Or I wouldn't have had small keys coming in here. But I have one. There's the item. Maester Thord. <clears throat> no, I got the map from Mothula. Big key was in the big chest. Don't need that. Yeah, Big Key and Big Chest is always nice, just because it literally rules out a thing that you can get. So it was... East Time was a pendant, which kind of sucks. Um, uh, it's, it's only possible in Skull Woods and Swamp. Those are the two dungeons where you don't need the Big Key to get to the boss. Uh, no matter what, like, no matter what restrictions. There are no big key doors in the dungeons <clears throat> that need to be opened. Well, 
Well, you see, what you do is you clip into the dungeon from another dungeon, and use the other dungeon's big key to lock that dungeon big key in the big chest. It's easy. All right. Well, we already got we already got fire rod and a glove <laughs> from a pendant dungeon. So who's to say that this pendant dungeon will be stacked with items? Also, we're already one potential key item in. Two items. Two items is a tough call, whether to keep going or whether to just not. Uh, I don't have too much more access without Titan's Mitts, without Mirror, without Hookshot. I don't have that much more stuff I can access. Uh, I could go beat Desert for an item, I believe. Um, TTS four items. <clears throat> Um, I still have the South Loop, which is, you know, Stumpy, Dig Game, Hype Cave. Eh. Um, yo, Naufa Arach with the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you very much for the support, dude. I appreciate it a lot. Welcome to the Pug Farm. Thanks for using that Twitch Primer on me. Still two items. <laughs> nice, we've done. <clears throat> Dog eat Pepsi. Also, what's up, Akira Alchemist? Two items with three locations left. One of these has to be a small key. So if this is an item, then the last item... One of the items is on blind either way. Um, but if that was an item, then big chest would have the small key in it. Oops. Norman what? Bullshire. What's up, Clad? How's it going, dude? Excuse me? <laughs> okay. So, at the very least, Ether might have been required. Uh... Oh, Diablo 2. <laughs> I don't know if you're trolling or not. Uh, my next race... Tournament match is on Thursday morning. 
Thursday morning and Thursday night. All right, games one and two of the finals. Um, and yo, Clad, Clad88 with the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you very much for the support, dude. I appreciate it a lot. Welcome to the Pug Farm. Hope you enjoy the new emotes. I'm almost a year and a half with this weirdo, Andy Blay. Uh, yo, Katie, with the 16 months in a row, almost a year and a half with this weirdo, Blay. Same. <laughs> Thank you very much for the continued support, Katie. I appreciate it a lot. Hope you're hope you're doing well. Tired AF, work sucks. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> okay. Give me the goodies. There's a mirror. Uh, okay, so, <sighs> Mirror will get me to all of East Death Mountain. Uh, I'm gonna check Bombo's tablets and K45 while I'm here. Hype caves are not hype, except for when they are. It's like the rando... The rando ideology. Things are never important, except when they are. What is EDT time in UTC? Uh, minus four? I think. So 9 a.m. or 10 a.m. EDT would be 2 p.m. UTC, I think, if I'm remembering my conversion correctly. Music is different, yes. Alright, so Hera. I'll probably wait to go beat Desert for when I get the mitts. Uh, although Lamo could have the mitts, in which case I'd be owned. <laughs> um well, we'll see. We'll see what happens after uh, Hera and East Death Mountain. <clears throat> no, this is the same MSU one stuff. Um, I'm waiting for. Uh, some final final touch-ups of some other MSU1 files to use, so I can change it up. Uh, that'll be more synthy, uh, but I like them a lot, so we'll see. I'm not sure, entirely sure how long it'll be before I get those, but that was close. Mushroom. Um, yeah, so the, the MSU1 chip, 
uh, has, uh, or forces the ROM to pull from PCM files instead of the normal, uh, from the normal sound files. And they have to be, like, appropriately numbered so that the game pulls the right track and stuff like that. Oops. <laughs> I wanted the book anyways. I had Mushroom on the mine. Get some shaded. There's the Titan's Mates. Alright. Good, good, good. Yo, Calgin85 with the tier 1 sub. Thank you very much for the uh, support. I appreciate it a lot. Welcome to the Pug Farm. Hope you enjoy uh, the new emotes. Thank you, thank you. Uh, no. If you use if you use MSU one for tournament races, they just don't ever use your audio. One item. Please give me that hot basement skip. Yeah. Like if they played if they played my MSU one music on the tournament restream, a they wouldn't they'd have to like make sure that all the music was appropriate beforehand, which there's no way to do. Like you can literally play any music through the game, so they could just like you know have whatever playing through their console, and there'd be no way for them to know. So they just won't play it on stream. And then even if they did, and it was all game music like mine is, they'd have the chat. Like I mean, you see me with 400 viewers, how many people come in saying, "What's this music?" Imagine a chat with, like, you know, 3,000 people in it <laughs> instead. It'd be... it'd be ridiculous. A heart. What kind of music do I like? Um... I, I'm a big fan of instrumental stuff. Like, I used to listen to a lot of uh, prog metal. Um, but I'm a... I don't know. I'm, I, it depends upon my mood. Like, I'll listen to rock. Uh, I don't listen to rap too much, or hip-hop or whatever. Uh, I don't listen to country at all. That's probably, like, the only genre that I really don't listen to. Um... But everything else I'll listen to depending upon my mood. K-pop. I don't mind K-pop. I don't go, like, I don't, you know, listen to K-pop. I'm like, oh yeah, let's listen to K-pop. But, like, if some of my friends are like, listen to this song, I won't, you know, not listen to it because it's K-pop. not a huge fan of classic rock. Some classic rock is good, but other classic rock is not. I like baby metal. Isn't that like the name of a group? <laughs> I've heard of I've heard of baby metal, but I've never listened to any of their stuff. Oh, was that the was that the group that like <laughs> Rob Zombie was like these girls go hard and then he took a whole bunch of shit for it because everyone thought he was like a pussy afterwards or something. <laughs> that rings a bell actually. <laughs> uh 
Uh, so we got the bow, we got tempered sword. Uh, I need hook shot. <clears throat> I need hook shot and Canis Maria, potentially medallions. Rob Zombie was 100% right. <laughs> Quake. So I need at least Quake, maybe Bombos, Hookshot, and Canis Maria. We're good to go. Hovering wear out my controller. Uh, it wears out my A button pad a little faster than all the other pads, but other than that, no, not really. So the only thing I could have gotten there was Canis Maria, and that would have just kind of hinted at where, or that would have been like Hookshot can't be in Turtle Rock, and that's it. <laughs> uh, oh god. Alright, let's go, uh... The hover button? They have controllers like that, Dark Strifle. Strifey. Uh, those are called turbo controllers. <laughs> if you, uh, set A to turbo on a turbo controller, and you just hold it down, you will hover perfectly over any gap you want. It would just be very easy to tell that you were using turbo because hovering that quickly is not possible by a human. Can you use keyboard macros, mod controllers for tournaments? Uh, you can, I think, but you can't do anything that a controller, like, that somebody on a console with a normal controller wouldn't be able to do. Um, yo, Scalaponk in with the seven months of Twitch Prime in a row. Thank you very much for the continued support, my dude. I appreciate it a lot. I think my favorite- I don't know what my favorite Ganon music is. TP- TP Ganon music is way up there. Uh, I'm not entirely sure about, you know, like, actual, like, final dungeon music wise, but TP is one of my favorite, like, Ganon fight musics. That'd be pretty cool, Glenn. The Ganondorf battle theme is one of my favorite Ganondorf battle themes. There was another item in here. Maybe not. Oh 
Yo, Bashbach1 with the uh, Twitch Prime sub. So thank you very much for the support, dude. I appreciate it a lot. Welcome to the Pug Farm. Hope you enjoy uh, the new emotes. Thank you, thank you, dude. All the Twitch Primers today. Zelda 2 just has, like, bangers all around. TBH. Also, depending upon what I get or don't get into AGDQ, uh, when those submissions come out, uh, I might be learning FSA on the side. Because it looks like a fun run. It used to look like a super not great run back when I first thought about picking it up in like 2013. Uh, but it looks a lot more fun now. Same Glam. FSA is Four Swords Adventures for the GameCube. Yeah. Thank you. Except the capture card. Ah. Yo, Hofer was here with 163 bits. Thank you very much, my dude. <laughs> uh, I appreciate it a lot. Hope you're doing well. So, the only other chest that's currently in Logic for me... Uh, is uh, the Ice Tea Room chest. I thought that, uh, I thought that guy was gonna own me, TBH. <laughs> I've gotten owned by that red jelly before, trying that hover. <laughs> There's only one more item in here. I got the red rupee and I got Quake. So I'm gonna guess that this next chest is gonna be the big key. <clears throat> I need to learn a little bit more about Ice Palace logic. Um, and like what is and isn't in logic without Hookshot and Canis Maria. Like, the only thing that I really know is, uh, that if Colster has a small key, then Colster technically required Canis Maria to get. Um, but the Hookshot logic is a little blurry for me. Um, yo, Bashbach with the 50 bits, the 40 and the 10. Thank you very much, dude. I appreciate it a lot. All the sleepy pug biddies. Dude, this headache. Whew. I don't know if... Ugh.
Okay. See, so that was the only other chest in logic for me. So it makes sense that the last item was there. Because no early small key and no hookshot. So, hookshot for Domo. <laughs> oh, mm -mm -mm -mm. I don't have enough magic. Here, actually, we're just no hookshot can be into a rock. Quake, Quake, and Samaria were both accessible without Hookshot. Without Hookshot. So this is a this is an interesting uh <clears throat> This is an interesting decision point. So I could go to Turtle Rock, which has many more items. Uh is a little slower without the hook shot. Um potentially get it there and be able to go mode Swamp and, you know, find the big key in, my, in Mire and go mode the rest of it. Or I could try to save Turtle Rock for last, which would save me an extra trip up Death Mountain. It would make Turtle Rock faster, and so it, this is a, this is one of those tough decisions that, like, there isn't really a right or wrong answer. <laughs> Uh, Swamp will be the third choice out of Meyer to Rock and Swamp, hands down. <clears throat> uh, no, I need I need Hookshot to beat Swamp. You cannot hover in Swamp to get to the boss, and you need the Hookshot to beat the boss also. So yeah, I'm not entirely sure what the uh, what the best decision here is. Like you might say Turtle Rock because A it has more items, B I got both Quake and Kane in Ice Palace, which is kind of leading me to Turtle Rock. Uh, but yeah, I'm not entirely sure. No, I haven't checked catfish. The three chests past the hookshot room require hookshot unless you get a small key early.
I haven't been paying attention. I know I got one item in here, but I don't know about the other. Uh, yes, Pyramid got checked. Uh, because I beat Agnum. The big key has to be on right side also. No, I don't know Lumberjack yet. I don't have Hookshot. I'm gonna laugh if it's on Lumberjack, because <laughs> I should have checked it when I did Hula Hand. Alright, that's the second item. I actually don't think I needed that small key. I am misremembering doors. For some reason I was thinking that this was a small key locked door. <laughs> Which is dumb. Easy any fairy skip. How do I base my decision looking for last item? Um like I said, it's some of it is, you know, not not necessarily obvious decisions. Like, like so in my current situation, I have Swamp, Mire, and Turtle Rock left. I can beat Mire and Turtle Rock, uh, but there's, you know, certain points to to take into account when deciding which one to go to first. Uh, Turtle Rock, A, you have to do most of it anyways, so getting all the chests isn't really that out of the way. Um, GG's. Love the stream and vods. Oh, got my nose. Uh, yo, the big nasty one with the tier 2 rolling deep big boy sub. Thank you very much, dude. Uh, glad you're enjoying the stream for eight months in a row. Thanks a lot for the support, dude. Um, yeah, so there's a couple things to take into account. Mire, if you find the big key, then you can, you know, go straight to the boss if you're in go mode already. Um, and checking some of the extra chests, depending upon where the big key is, can add a pretty significant amount of time to your, to your Mire clear time. Um, where Turtle Rock, a lot of the stuff is on the way, not super far out of the way, and you have to check most of it anyways. Um, yeah, thanks, Sakura. Um, disadvantage of doing Turtle Rock first is, A, in my current situation, A, it's slower without Hookshot, and B, it would require me to climb up Death Mountain a second time to, uh, to get to Ganon's Tower, which is, you know, slower than only doing it once. Um, Turtle Rock does have the six items with Mimic Cave included compared to the two in Misery Mire. Um, so there's, there's like a lot of really tiny factors to take into, in, take into consideration, and some people weigh some of those tiny factors more than others in their mind when they are, uh, when they are making decisions. Like, for example, you know, climbing up here without... <laughs> The hookshot is much longer than it would be with the hookshot. That's another thing to take into account. So, like, the extra trip up Death Mountain is even more costly. Uh, just because this first trip is super out of the way. When will the next Key Sanity tournament be? <laughs> That's a good question. The next tournament is going to be fun. Keep your keep your keep your eyes and ears open for for next tournament information. Just uh just yeah. I'm super I'm super burned out tournament wise. You know, I I did the Key Sandy tournament, went to the finals, I did the the fall tournament. And, uh, and went, uh, went to nine weeks, nine weeks. I tied for ninth. I'm super burned out on tournaments. Am I entered into the SM Link to the Past tournament? Yes, I am. Key saying is the most interesting to watch. Some people feel that way, and some people feel that it is the least interesting to watch. So, <laughs> everyone has their preferences. 
I've done two key sanities in the last couple uh, weeks, and they've both been real bad seeds. Am I ever going to go back and beat Zelna's world record time? What do you mean, go back and beat? <laughs> I never beat him in the first place, so there's not really a going back and beating. There's a just beating. And no, <laughs> I don't. My next speedrun project, Link to the Past Wise, uh, is going to be taking my reverse boss order record back from not Zelma. Uh, Gerdo beat my record by a little less than three minutes, um, with a much newer route than my record was on. Dude, I hate Chain Chomps, they're actually stupid. But yeah, I I do kind of want to take my energy time down a little more. Like, I have... My PB is not uh, as good as it could be at my current skill level. Um, yeah, 2906 is easily beatable. I participated in the summer tourney? Uh, yes. I think. <clears throat> I thought it started tomorrow, but apparently it starts today. Uh, but I'm in the Discord. Yeah, it's the SG1 futon. Yeah. I, I 124 is easily doable. Easily. It would take... It would just take me doing runs. Well, it's just qualifiers for now. Um, but. When's the finals? Uh, if you type an estimation mark Torny, you can get all the finals information you could want. And if I had to bet, I'm going to guess that every one of our finals matches is going to be on Speed Gaming. One. Obviously not confirmed until the day of. Yeah, Glenn. I I promised that I wasn't gonna touch RBO again until somebody beat my record. And once somebody did, I would destroy them right back. So, Gero's gonna get a piece of the uh Andy Clip Master competition. <laughs> Why does that say 10 a.m. EDT, 6 p.m. EDT? Because two races are on Thursday. One is at 10 a.m. and one is at 6 p.m. One for the EU peeps and one for the, the NA peeps. I'm an honorary EU peep. <laughs> My sleep schedule is... Yeah, you go live at like midnight for me or something like that and stream until the early AMs. Is finals best of five? No. It's the best of three. Oh god.
I'm worried. I don't like this position. <laughs> didn't want to go for the double there, just because I didn't like how low and far right he was. Also no hook shot. Yes, Kira. Well, I think I think what's happening is there's not as much Link to the Past on Speed Gaming Network right now, so I'm getting some viewers that are new to uh, my stream. Not necessarily like new to knowing who I am, but new to actually my channel and not watching me on Speed Gaming, you know. So a lot of people are here to watch some. Uh, Watch some some rando. Uh, if you type in like, there's a there's a guide in my command that you can look at. <clears throat> are you on console or uh, are you still playing on emulators, Kira? Ernestus Ness. Uh, it's still not too hard, honestly. Um, <laughs> your rando fix? Sorry, she. Um, what's that ped? Good question. I don't give a heck about what's on pedestal. Because it's not the hook shot. Guaranteed 100%. It's not the hook shot. Yeah, getting the audio files together is is the the harder part. Dude, who's who's willing to put it all on the line? Hook shot in Swamp Palace, not on Ped. All the Ped dreamers can get owned. Yeah, thanks, Danger Cake. Who's got the cojones? Yeah, creating a MSU pack is a little more complicated, but I'm sure you can find somebody to help you out with it, like, in your community. Like, I had somebody set up the files for me initially. in the bottom U-tunnel chest of Swamp. I don't even know what that means, Feiyu. Oh, I understand. The the chest under the big chest room. I understand now. Glenn, I can send you my files if you want to, like, look at it and see how it works or something like that. What's the proper chest? I think that's the compass chest. If I'm not mistaken. 
But I think it should work the same way on SD to SNES as it does on emulator. Start making one of the SMRP music. Nice. I also need to download the uh, the SA1 beta firmware and play some KSS with it. Well, okay, so during random races that are like on speed gaming or whatever, you know, so you can have any any audio file play through MSU1. So like I could have, you know, just random guy yelling profanities as my audio. And speed gaming or whatever, whoever's doing the tournament wouldn't have any way to know what the music is until it played. So you can use MSU1 audio during tournaments, but they will never put your audio on the screen. Um Are there pre-made layouts with Streamlabs for a stream screen setup? I mean, like the... I, I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't know if there's pre-made layouts or not. I, you know, I had my layouts made by an artist. So I've never looked at any pre-made stuff before. Yeah, they're not super hard to do. Like, like I'm, I'm pretty stupid, and I could probably make a layout if I wanted to. Um, <laughs> the like the biggest thing is getting like dimensions of like the game screen and stuff correct, which is a lot easier than you'd think. Yeah, you could also just give an artist money. Like, making layouts is relatively easy. So you could just give an artist money and be like, Hey, make me... Can you make me a 4x3 layout with a webcam box on it? Okay. 15 bucks. 30 bucks. Whatever it is. Ah. All right. Who's ready for vanilla? Vanilla hookshot. You also don't even need a. <clears throat> you don't even need a a layout. You can just put the game, put your webcam, and like make them all like neat and and orderly, and it still looks fine. Yo, check out that vanilla hook shot. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Alright. I'm checking pedestal. Who's got the cones? Who's willing to put their money where their mouth is? Pedestal is not gonna have hook shot. Just couch cash.
Money where my mouth is. <laughs> Andy was right. <laughs> Yo, Erky Parn clocks and Victor Nup with the hundred bits of pop. Thank you guys very much. I appreciate Sorry it. For the so much for hook on pad. <laughs> Keep up the awesomeness, my guy less than three. Uh, and yo, Iceman F1 with the hundo biddies. Thank you very much. So much for your pedestal. And well, you know, with the 500 bits, rip the ped seed. Thank you guys very much. I appreciate it a lot. Do I do item dense locations now? Yeah, pretty much. Pod has one item left because of an item at Helma, but Eastern has four items left because of the green pendant. Um, so Eastern is just a much more valuable check than me at the moment. And then there's also, you know, Catfish, which is super slow. That's two items. <clears throat> um, depending upon how you move in the skeleton room, uh, it spawns anywhere from two to four. Oh god, I did rather be drinking. Rather be drinking with the 11 months in a row. Thanks for subscribing for almost a year. I appreciate it a lot, dude. Almost one whole year. Also, shout outs to almost 500 of you guys in here. Damn, son. What? 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 Okay, you win. <laughs> oh, I missed the switch. Yo, my boy at Syllogism. With the two thousand biddies. Thank you very much, my dude. I appreciate it a lot. Hope you're doing well. Thank you, thank you. Alright. So for those of you tuning in, or who are like, you know, not regulars of the stream, tomorrow at 2 p.m. Eastern, I will be doing a Hell Key Sanity randomizer. Uh, if you're not entirely sure what that is, um, that is a key sanity randomizer mixed with a max setting enemy randomizer mixed with a insanity, insanity entrance shuffle randomizer. Um, so if you would like to, you know, tune in for anywhere from four to eight hours of a randomizer action that is confusing to you and to me, uh, be sure to come back tomorrow at 2 p.m. Eastern. Um... Um, all right, hold on. It's a good time for a Twitch Prime lesson. Yo, chat, do you guys know about Twitch Prime? Twitch Prime is, uh, is pretty, it's pretty cool. It's, a. Uh, <laughs> if you have Amazon Prime, you already have Twitch Prime. Uh, Twitch Prime is a nice Twitch feature that you get through Amazon, where uh, you get a free subscription 
to any channel of your choosing once a month. Um, <laughs> Twitch Prime also, I already did this, Twitch Prime also gets you some free games and really cool in-game loot for games like PUBG and Fortnite. <laughs> oh man, this name is going to, uh, to own me pretty hard. I'm just going to call you Poe. Poe! With the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you uh, very, very much for the support. I appreciate it a lot. Welcome to the Pug Farm. Hope you enjoy the new emotes. Thanks for that hot Twitch Primer. If it was Pug G. I'm pretty sure it's either here or at Catfish. I don't think I have anything else... Left. That's not true, actually. I have other stuff left. Um, this is not the correct decision to make. Um, <laughs> well, that's fine. Twitch Prime Primer? Yep. You got it. So there's still, there's still Graveyard Ledge, there's still King's Tomb, there's still the whole Smith sequence, so Hammer Peg, Smith, and Purple Chest. Then Catfish. Yeah, they'll, they'll give you, like, free Overwatch crates sometimes. They'll give you, like, like currently they have, like, some free games on there that you can load through the Twitch launcher. Um, they have, like, PUBG Twitch Prime crate that you can get that has, like, you know, visual accessories. Uh, they'll give Fortnite stuff away sometimes. Uh, it's different every month or two. So it's definitely worth it. And then you also get, you know... Like, buying Amazon Prime, you also get a ton of perks through Amazon Prime. Uh, it's definitely worth it. So, like, I pay, you know, Amazon Prime's 120 bucks a year. Uh, and getting a free sub a month, that's like 60 bucks a year that I use on Twitch subs that I don't actually pay. Because I have Twitch, or I have Amazon Prime already. So, it's definitely, definitely a bargain. Yeah, you get Prime Video, you also get ad-free content. Ton of perks. Not only is it ad-free content, but if you have Twitch Prime, as long as you don't have your ad blocker enabled, I still get the ad impression for it. So if you have Twitch Prime, be sure to take uh, Twitch off of your ad blocking websites so that we can get them pennies. You can also start a free trial of Twitch Prime and get one sub from it, I'm pretty sure. But yeah, if you still have the ad blocker up, um, it won't load the ad for you even though you have Twitch Prime. But yeah, you could just uh, set up Twitch, the Twitch domain as a, as a white, or whitelist the Twitch domain. Yo, Mikchi with the Twitch Prime sub. Thank you very much for the support. I appreciate it a lot. Welcome to the Pug Farm. <sighs> I found it.
Yo, is that the McLagging? Twitch has Facebook plugins? It was not <laughs> catfish here. Take my piece. Yo, EMP any amount of money with a hundred biddies. Thank you very much, my dude. I appreciate it a lot. What is that? Musk creep. Hell yeah. <laughs> I know, the heart on the track, like the tracker is made for like, you know, more than just me to use. Um, <laughs> so it's like a heart piece counter. You can, you know, go through and, you know, keep track of when you would get a health NT. refill. Is it accurate enough? Uh, yes, I have hovered on a, I've hovered on a Super NT and I've hovered on a, on a SNES Classic before, and they're both decent enough to hover on for me. I'm missing something. Uh, no, hovering is doable on any version of the game. Uh, I'm playing on a regular SNES currently, so yes. Is hovering on a Retron 5 possible? I don't know what that is, so I don't know. Uh, no, if, we're, if you're a Twitch partner, you get uh, a small percentage of ad revenue. I can't talk about how much, but like if you look at an ad on a partner channel, it'll usually say this ad directly supports the channel you're on. Like if you if you see an ad on my stream, it'll say this channel this ad directly supports Andy. Um, yeah, hovering on a console is gen like any kind of console will most likely be better and doable than on emulator because emulator just drops input sometimes. I made a bad decision there and poked right instead of left. Always enjoyed your content. I know it's not much, but I just wanted to say I appreciate what you do. Um, yo, Full Metal Adept with the 100 bits. Thank you very much for the support, dude. I appreciate it a lot. Dude, sometimes people feel bad about, like, you know, not being able to subscribe or, you know, only being able to give 100 bits. But really, any support is, like, more than I expect from people. So thank you, for real. Alright, you guys know what time it is. It's time for the Ganon's Tower guessing game. Pick a number between 1 and 22. How many locations am I going to have to check before finding the big key in Ganon's castle? All I need is the big key and one small key uh, <clears throat> to go upstairs and finish the game. And if you're one of the first two people to guess the right number, you might... Well... <laughs> I'll let <laughs> I'll let the winner pick what weapon I go upstairs with and kill Agnon with. I mean, you can pick between the hammer, the bug net, if I have it, which I do, the bug net or the sword. Please get out of my face! Get out of my face! Yeah, you need the number to be the first thing uh, in your message. Bug net. But you gotta win first, Kura. Don't get ahead of yourself. Don't don't get ahead of yourself. HUD not updated. Excuse me? Not not about the HUD not being updated. Yeah, I see. It's not updated. Excuse me, was that me getting hit by that Lionel? That didn't make any sense. 
I don't have the shovel. I have that, I have that, I have that, I have... <sighs> Go mode! Anyways. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Dude, what if I just screw everything up and intentionally skip some chests to throw off the number? There's one. There's two. Like, what if I went right side and only opened one of the chests? <laughs> Hookshot was, a uh, From the Smiths. Tracker shield! There's four. There's five. There's six. And seven. There's nine, eight, eight. God. I don't think I've ever hit both of the switches with the blue boomerang before. <laughs> that was interesting. Nine. I was too fast. <laughs> I actually need bombs, so we're not gonna we're not gonna spam my bombs away. That's a Vince Knight. That's a nice 13. get a good GT. Feels bad. Feels bad. Power slicker, no. There's 14. We got that butter. Who doesn't like some butter? Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, half magic. Nice stair lag. Look at the magic. The magic of no magic. Uh, if you're grabbing a wall while using the cape, uh, it doesn't use any magic. It's as simple as that. As you can see on my controller input up there, I'm only holding the A button while facing the wall. It doesn't despawn because it doesn't hit anything, Nova. It only despawns when it, once it hits something.
that was number uh, 18. So we got 19. 20. 21. Oh, JK. <laughs> 22. Yo, Stashio Cat with the win and Emok81 with the runner up. Congratulations, you two. Alright. Alright, Stashio Cat. You get to pick what weapon I use on Aghanim 2. Alright? You get to pick between the hammer, the sword, and the bug net. Oh god, what happened? Guys, my game's broken. What happened? Also, I'm waiting for Stashio Cat to, to pick. Also, Stashio Cat, welcome to the Pug Farm. Hope you enjoy the new emotes. Uh, give my boy Dr. Fritz a big ol' thank you. Uh, where is Stashio Cat? Do you read me? There he is. Stashio cat, pick a weapon. Hammer time. I see it now. Alright, we're good. Ta-da. Man. I don't know what happened to my game. Something weird must have... Must have entered the Matrix or something. Oh, I almost got the triple. Oh, this is bad timing. Yep. Boom! Now I can despawn Ganon once he turns into a bat. Get on. Get on, Ganon! Yeah, thanks, Volteca. I only skipped, like... Three things outside a dungeon, and then... The last four chests in GT. Or I guess I skipped five chests in GT. And then, you know, various other random stuff in, in, in other dungeons, like Skullwood's big chest I skipped because the big key was in it. Ow. Oh, I almost killed myself. Here we go. Swag. <laughs> Success. I did it.
All right. So uh, I'm gonna play a short ad, um, and I'll probably do another one of these. I don't really feel like playing Chasm today. Uh, we have the SMZ3 weekly at nine, which is in less than three hours. So a little less than three hours. So I'm playing ad. Go use the bathroom if you're gonna head out. Thanks for watching. Um, should I bop that follow button? Um, I'm gonna go use the restroom. I'll be back in just a minute. Oh, hey. <sighs> Where? goodness yeah how you guys doing how's everybody's Monday yeah nice mark <laughs> open mode in honor of Lanxian <laughs> yeah, what happened on Twitter
<laughs> oh my god. <sighs> Yo, thanks, Beth of Joy. I appreciate it a lot. Here's my opponent in the finals, Christos Owen. The Battle of the Old Boys. Let's see if anybody wants to do a... <clears throat> do a race or something. I don't even recognize any of these names that race. Holy smokes. The people that are have recently... Uh, you would ask if you wanted to co-op overall glitches or something soon? <laughs> like, all the names that have recently talked in the race planning channel, I do not recognize. I, I recognize, like, Argel XD, maybe, if I'm remembering correctly, and that's pretty much it. Chat, you want to see an overall glitch seed with my inferior bad overall glitch knowledge? Yo, same, Sakura. <laughs> <laughs> 